Hello friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and in this tutorial I'm going to talk about how you can create flange cutout stamp. The flange cutout stamp is a tool which is coming under the stamping and it is coming under the generative sheet metal design workbench in KTRV5. So to create a flange cutout stamp firstly you need to have a wall and then you need to create a closed profile. So firstly let's open up a generative sheet metal design workbench and then sh set the sheet metal parameters and then go for creating a wall so that you have a component or a sheet metal component on which you can work with. So I'm just creating a sheet metal component there and then creating a wall and then select a plane, click on a sketch I mean a face of the sheet metal you need to select and then go for the sketch and then create a closed profile. So you could just go for a rectangle. So for a better understanding I'm just going for another profile and make it still a closed one. That's not helping. Okay. So that creates a closed profile there. Come out of the sketch and then go for stamping and flange cutout stamp. You can find it on insert, stamping and flange cutout stamp. You could also find it in the stamping, cutting stamping toolbar and in the uh, stamping drop down button. So just go for flange cutout stamp and go for the preview. And you could see the preview over here you have an option to disable the radius so that uh, you don't have the radius or the fillet over there and you have an option to increase the height and uh, decrease the angle too you could try that and that's all about the uh, flange cutout stamp which is coming under the sheet generated sheet metal workbench in KTRV5 if you have any doubts on this particular tool Please comment below the video and I'll be getting in touch with you. You could also write to me at getio.pro.user at gmail.com regarding any project inquiries or uh, project assistance. And that's all about this tutorial. Please stay tuned. Thank you so much for watching.